Katie, Kate, 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 Kate. Any updates? Uh, like Ailey called about prom. Yes. Yes. I'll be back. Get it? Arnold Schwarzenegger, Terminator, I'll be back. <laughs> Uh, Luke gets very intense about prom. Uh, last year he made us sleep over at the venue, um, and we had to watch over the decorations. The floor was very cold. So I am the president of the activities committee. Some may call me the leader. <laughs> but I do think that prom, in general, is one of the biggest deals in the whole year. Uh, it could even be one of the biggest deals in the whole world. And this year's prom is going to be especially uh, special. Hello? Ah, oh, Carolyn, how are you doing? Yes, yes ma'am. Listen, I called about prom. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's why I called you back. This Braveheart theme is just not gonna work out. It's over budget, there's not enough money. What? But, uh, I thought, but like, uh, Braveheart and Mel and, uh, for freedom, you know? Listen, I'm you know? really busy right now. I don't have time for this. Choose another theme and call me back. But I, I thought we could, uh... Could you please stop that? No. As a senior on activities committee, I value the countless lunches I have spent with Mr. Clower. Everything from winter formal to prom, I have given everything to this committee. And kids these days, they think they can just not show up to Monday meetings? Do you know how valuable those are? The amount of hours wasted. Kate, can you come in? Do you need something? Legaley called back, and she said that my brilliant plan of having prom theme as Braveheart is out of our budget. So I need you to gather up some faculty so they can pitch in their ideas. I mean, we're the activities committee. We can make the decision ourselves. No, I am the voice of the people. Like, uh, like Mel and Braveheart. I'll give the people what they want. So, uh, Mr. Frank, what do you think the theme of prom should be? I think prom should be about birds. Birds are totally awesome. I mean, we have love birds, we have all kinds of predatory birds, and they have feathers. They're amazing. I mean, we could have birds all over the inside of the prom area. You could have stuffed birds, you could have posters of birds, um, you could have birds hanging, like stuffed birds hanging from the ceiling, little bird beaks. Let's see here, let me draw some. Uh, we had to tell him no. I felt really bad about it. I don't know why they didn't want to go with the bird idea. I mean, the bird prom, bird-themed prom would be the best prom ever. It's, I mean, birds are totally natural. Like, how stupid and idiotic not to go with birds for the prom. I mean, there could be birds all over the inside of the prom. They obviously love each other. They're all mating all the time and having more birds all around us. So, I mean, they should have gone with birds. Come on. Bird themed prom? Who doesn't want that? Okay, so, uh, Miss Pacalao, you said you had a theme for prom? Well, Moulin Rouge. Moulin Rouge, is that like an, it's like an Indian thing, right? Actually, uh, Moulin Rouge was a nightclub in Paris in the early Kate, 20s. Kate, are you serious? I I'm trying to work here. Are you really interrupting me right now? I'm trying to break a cultural boundary. Unprofessional. 
So I called Miss Legaley and I told her about Miss Pacalao's theme for prom as a Moulin Rouge and I, I said it was a nightclub in Paris in like 2001 or 2002 or something, I don't know. I don't know why, but she said yes. So I guess that's the one we're sticking with, a Moulin Rouge. I thought Braveheart was a better idea. Braveheart's really cool, but... Let me hear your flow, sisters. Hey, sister, go.